Hello everybody and welcome to Excel Made Easy. I'm your Excel Guru and today I'm going to tell you uh, how to use the hyperlink feature in Excel. Well, hy hyperlinks can be used to link a word, a sentence, a photograph, a graph to an Excel file, a folder in your computer, to a website, to an email address and all such things. It's a wonderful thing. It can help you so much. Uh, let us see. Uh, there are two ways of putting a, a hyperlink. The first one is right clicking on the place where you want to have the hyperlink and then choosing the hyperlink option. Open hyperlink or there is one more way. Type something say Y-P-E-R-L-I-N-K and then do a control K. Control K opens the hyperlink for you. Now this is something that we're gonna check. Uh, link to existing file or web page. This is most commonly if you would like to uh, hyperlink a website to this uh, to whatever in Excel. Say I link it to www. Uh, this is my YouTube channel. Okay, so I would link it to www.youtube.com. Excel made easy slash Excel made easy. So now it is hyperlinked to that. See if I roll over my mouse over it, it will read that. Uh, it's hyperlinked to this specific channel. So that's one way of hyperlinking it to a website. Uh, let's say another thing. Let's do another thing. So let's also, to do that, let's also edit this. Uh, we can edit this hyperlink by just right clicking it and click clicking on the hyper edit hyperlink. And you can remove the link like this. The link is gone. Right click it again and say hyperlink. And we can even link it to any of the folders over here in your computer. You can choose your folder and link it over there. Or place in this document. See, uh, if you want that whenever you click somewhere, uh, your, uh, the computer should take you, the hyperlink should take you to a specific cell on your Excel file. So yes, that can be done. Uh, on sheet two, I have uh, done something. I have uh, written something on the cell G4. Let us see what is that. So I'll type in the cell address G4. That's very important. You need to remember the cell address. So click sheet two and G4 and click OK. So if I click it over here now, it will take me to G4. What I had mentioned over here was Excel made easy. You can even hyperlink it back to sheet one. So it, this is an F3, okay? So <laughs> let's see. We click it over here. We do a control K, place in this document, sheet one, and we type in the address F3. We click on okay, and see? <laughs> they are hyperlinked to one, one, one another. And there is a one more, um, there are a few more things that can be done. Say, let's edit this one first. And, sorry, edit hyperlink. And we remove this link and we do it uh, another hyperlink and we can create a new document. You can use this to create a new document. You can also use this to send a, to uh, link it to an email address. And there are a few things that uh, two more things I would like to tell you about the hyperlink feature. This is more about Excel 2007 and above. Say if you type in the website address www.face book.com slash excel made easy that's me it's become hyperlinked automatically that's one of the features of excel and the same would happen to any email id uh, say if i type in my email id uh, say it is contact at the rate my e lesson dot org it will become hyperlinked automatically so that is what hyperlink is well this file is available for free download on my website excelmadeeasy.weebly.com very soon we are coming with a new website myelesson.com.org wonderful website would cater to so many things and you can go to the training files page and download the training file for free. You can also go to the video tutorial page and see all the video tutorials we have. And you can also go to Facebook and like us or like me over there and share my work with others. Share the work. That's the main motto. Let's share knowledge. So this was your Excel Guru signing off for the day. Have a wonderful day ahead. Happy Excel learning.